Um, YouTube question from Trollika1138. Which music video was your favorite to film? Definitely. Yes, Definitely. I would agree with you. Um, so I think Mercy was a learning curve. Um, I actually put a lot of time into building that set, and you can actually see us destroying the set. I will put a link so you guys can see the videos. But the video doesn't destroyed. really show how much the set like got destroyed. Like you guys, they they trashed it. Well, like, pretty much the whole set was made out of styrofoam, styrofoam right. and duct tape and Bristol board. And I think I cleaned out maybe four WalMarts. Uh, buying all of their yellow and black duct tape and all of their yellow and black bristol board right. and I had to like scour the, the entire countryside trying to find more of it um, and it was also a bitch to clean up because my brilliant idea was to put the duct tape on the floor but you left then, it way too long yeah I left it too long like fused to the tiles <laughs> not a good idea but Limp was super fun even though it took us a very long time to film we started in October actually but you should get props for Mercy because it spent four or five days you built that set pretty much by yourself and Francesca yeah. helped and Francesca helped me yeah. and the two ladies in the, the shadow the creatures uh, Sarah and Ashley props to them for completely turning into my vision and also they had black makeup stuck to them for like the next like five days and I felt so bad they couldn't get it off so thanks girls oh that was hot <laughs> Um, but I think the cool thing about Limp that people may not know is because we filmed it over a long period of time trying to get band members here and there and trying to get Brad, the zombie who's available, and our awesome makeup girl Sarah uh, involved, um, we had to like do it over a period of time and uh, all the stuff that we shot inside the car and in the actual performance band sequence was all done in the snow. Yeah. And all the stuff that we filmed outside, we had to get done so quick because it was starting to get colder and colder. And the snow was going to come any minute, and we just had to film it all so it looked consistent. So we didn't have to wait an entire other year until it was fall again. Yeah. But we fit it all in. It was cool. Yes. We came up with a lot of cool tricks. Uh, I really loved a lot of the tricks we came up with. And when you built the stop motion animation uh, set, that was cool. Yeah. It took us, we spent like one whole night shooting just that car. Uh, going, going up, up the, the hill, hill. And we probably shot it for about seven hours or something. We had a lot of fun. I think we were getting a little tipsy while we were doing Yeah, it. we had like, some wine. What do you have to do? What else? <laughs> we're not, you, there's no acting. In the, yeah. I think that was cool. Yeah, it was totally fun. Yeah. So lit for sure. I think like a stop motion animation video we've talked about, would, I think would be really cool. It's going to take, it's gonna it's gonna take, take some forever, serious though. time to work on it, yeah. but I think it's something that we're probably going to put, in, put into place. And everything. Yeah. yeah. A good idea coming up. All right. Next question from Destiny Carwacky asked via Facebook. What was Car wacky? it? Carwacky. Carwacky. That's a cool name. You, what was do you it? drive a wacky car? Yes. Carwacky. Right, <laughs> what was it like having a concert with Hollywood Undead? So I think we kicked ass pretty much for our first show. It was a pretty awesome first show. Yeah, it was a totally good show. We had a lot of fun. We played well. We Although played awesome. MD had an incident with yes. one of the members from Hollywood Undead. And unfortunately, because we're not super familiar with the band and they always wear masks, we didn't really know who was who until you injured one of them. Yeah, like I don't know. They're walking around here and there. I don't know what they look like. And I smashed some, I opened the door into another band member's hand, which I didn't realize. It was an accident, pure accident. But he definitely was upset with me. Uh, yeah. More than I would be upset with somebody. I'd be like, okay, that really hurt, that sucks. But he's like, man, my hand. And I was like, dude, I'm really sorry about that. Like, I don't even know he's really in the band yet, but he's like, oh, man, my hand. So I like apologized profusely, but I was like, man, this guy just does not want to take an apology. And then I saw him playing a few minutes, like you know, an hour later on stage, and I was like, "Oh, it's like the main one of the main guys." I like, smashed his hand pretty bad. So. Yeah, that was. I don't think they like me. Let's do that. <laughs> but it was an awesome show, and if you guys are at all listening, we would like to thank you and thank. Yeah, they were awesome to have. And us on thank there. Live Nation and Zeke yep. Myers for yeah. putting us on that gig. So it was awesome. Totally. We had a good time. And the crowd that. Went. And everybody that saw us yeah, in the show was so awesome. Yeah, yeah, nice to meet you, and I hope you guys are um, around for our next show. And keep following, yeah. Totally. We'll be in Toronto soon. 
Okay, so the highest rated comment on YouTube was actually uh, by Miss Dream Freak, who writes, Would Sky be back, or would Sever take over completely? Will Sky continue to do makeup tutorials or fashion tips on her Sky Sweetened video YouTube channel, and maybe show some of Sever's fashion style? Okay, well this question confuses me a little bit, because... You're supposed to be writing us. I don't know who Sky is. Well, I kidnapped her and put her oh. in the attic. Right, you did. That's who I keep hearing over time. Yeah, talks. she's yeah. up there. Right. So I'm sure she'll continue doing her own thing from her little cage, but I really have no concern about what she's doing with her channel or her makeup or whatever. I'm just going to do my thing. So here she's a little bitch, though. <laughs> nice, nice. Yeah. Yeah. I like just going upstairs <laughs> sometimes and just seeing her crying in her cage. Working with you sometimes is just uh, remarkable. Yeah. Moments. We are moments not the magic. same person, just so you moments know. So, if you're time. talking to me, you're talking to Sever. You can talk to her on her time, but... You're pointing like it's like you're saying her to me. No. Not her to me. <laughs> um, but if you guys have a lot of questions about that, maybe you can ask her. Hmm? 